Did you see that? The void woke up. They made short bloody work of our ship. No telling if there are more ashore. Mm. And I doubt that that voice will save any of us again. Ah, there's a really way to get rid of this bar here. has a small mirror in his hands. He holds it up at angles, inspecting his eyes, his chin, the crown of his head. He spots you, and his arms snap to his side. I spot you a ship. Please lock me. Yeah, that time he's still on the ship. Not for I will also throw in a... this fish. This maybe this orange juice was not. No. No, no. Oh. Screw you. I mean, how many trades do you need to make? I'm not Should supposed to talk to lizards. Really? Like, what kind of stories? I mean, I'm asking for a friend. A dragon that marries an elf? That sounds silly. Can I hear it anyway? You warmly tell the tale of the dragon, but despite your best efforts, you notice that your knowledge of legends and monsters is somehow upsetting the child. Hmm. Are you a sorcerer? One of those guys that brings the bad void things here? The child looks at you straight up. I don't see any sauce on you or me. No one cares where I go. It's good, you they know, up to the they're gone now. The magisters took them no. already. Oh. I guess oh. now they're cured. Oh. I'm like, and maybe in the way area, I'm not too far. I'm up by the first die. set of enemies we're going to fight. All right, cool. I'll take the lead. Shit out of these things. Alright, hold on one second, let me do something. I 
fuck does it say it's, it knows me? Stare at the slain beasts and comment that they must have been the cause of the shipwreck. They're just animals. Easy enough to euthanize. I don't relish having killed these creatures, but it couldn't be helped. Let's see if I can get rid of these things by doing this. Fake full screen. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, it's my boss. You spot a strange lizard <laughs> gazing over the water with Yes. Are we you gonna have him follow him? Ship. It would seem you're not the only one who survived uh, the tentacles of the deep. I don't know. Do you do you want him? Not really. Alright. The lizard turns about with the graceful ease of a duck. I did survive. You have hand over heart. He salutes you with I a I kind of want to try and get uh, if Ben yes, I'm whatever sure his name nevertheless. is. Now then, and, um, he watches you depart. Maybe uh, Fane and see if we can get Fane to be the healer. Yeah, maybe. I don't know if heal Fane will heal, but yeah, we can try it. I mean. Uh, so where? We're looking for a shovel too. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, there's a cat. The cat's here. Oh, we have to keep this cat alive. Yeah, spring straight at you. So the thing is, if we keep this cat alive till we leave, like once we escape, yeah, uh, we get I get him as a fucking like familiar, like I can summon him. Alright, cool. Hey, Mister, it's a lot nicer here than that stinking boat, huh? I'm sure glad some of the others made it out alive too. So. Alright, this kid's got something to try. I always want to talk. Can't I just play here I'll with trade myself you a while? This worthless shell for that shirt. What is stained? No? Fair enough.
wonder where this leads. Uh, do you want to talk to him? Um. So that depends. Who do you want to be in control of? Because you're going to have one follower and I'm going to have one follower. Oh, okay. So... Uh, are you wanting the other one to control the other one then, I guess? So, I, I don't like controlling phone. Control you okay. walk up to a skeleton, unlike any you are approaching, you bugger. bugger. How on earth am I supposed to... Oh. Perhaps... Fain is... Fain is Paddy, right? <laughs> Skeletal fingers reach down and right. grip the skin of the dead man's <laughs> face, pulling padding. sharply upwards. After a few more tugs at the man's cheeks, damnation, that stuck fast. I'm gonna fast. have to take a uh, I wonder. bathroom ah! break. No, no worries. Stay back. I'll, I'll just uh, do this. Uh, you don't so I'm not skipping a whole conversation for a, a video. Run along, for... won't you? I have business to attend to. Oh yes, an exceptionally common but exceptionally valuable commodity, a face. A face that seems rather stubbornly attached to his skull. I would normally employ a tool to delicately but viciously rip the face from the body. I could then craft a mask to hide my bone. But as I lack such a tool... The skeleton grabs the corpse by the cheeks and pulls hard, grunting in frustration as the body's skin holds firm. Oh, don't be ridiculous. I have important things to do on Reaper's Coast. I cannot simply sit about waiting for the rest of you to die so I may continue my business in peace. No, I may be an eternal, but my patience has its limits. Indeed, I may be the only eternal. My people seem rather absent, at least from this realm. As for the others, well... There is an excavation site at the Black Pit's oil fields. Perhaps there I'll find my answers. A cult? Hardly. We were a race that existed before the idea of race was needed. We were all one. I could ask you to imagine an Eternal as a creature of incredible intelligence and skill. But I fear the limits of your imagination would not do us justice. We studied the mysteries of the universe. We created works of great art. We... We disappeared. But I will find them. Wherever they are, I will find them. We will have our world again. Ah, well, that is the curious thing. They are clearly absent from this world, and yet they are. Everywhere. Every one of your races resembles them in some manner. And the statues you have built to your gods look remarkably familiar. Perhaps my people have ascended to some new realm. Or perhaps your gods are merely a folk memory. Regardless, they are not here. But I will find them. Wherever they are, I will find them. I suppose, circumstances being what they are, it could be advantageous. You seem more at ease in this world than I. A guide would certainly be useful. Excellent. While we are conversing, perhaps you notice that I am rather skilled in, well, all things. Of course, the arcane arts are my little speciality. But being a brilliant wizard does not mean I cannot handle blade or bow. So. Which do you require for this enterprise of yours? Much magic? I was controlling the powers of the universe while your people were still... Uh, ...doing whatever it is you used to do. What speciality would you prefer? Uh, I can turn him into an, a, a cleric if you want heal and support. Yeah? Um, yeah, I mean, sounds good to me. Alright, cool. I could do that with one hand behind my spine. Now, shall we get on? Splendid. Right. Very well. 
He seems pretty keen on dead cleric. Nice. <laughs> Let's hope uh, he, his idea of healing isn't just poisonous as all. Let's go kill some turtles. Do you want to go kill the turtle? Fox levels up. Levels up a bit. Do we level up? Hey. Yeah, we'll level up. Oh shit, we did level up. I just gave Fane a poison potion. Nice. Uh, I've leveled him up so he, he knows all his uh, basics. Nice. Make sure you put on another skill. If you have another skill, do you, I don't have one. If you have a fourth skill that you can put on, do it. I guess I'll do that next time. I just increase like the skills I've got right now. Okay. Uh, Dome of protection, though. That sounds useful. Did you already talk to this chick? Nah. I can never get to talk to me. She so. eyes you suspiciously. Please. Yeah, that's what she says to me. I'll try it again. Where is she? You go with us? Who are you? Are you from the shelter? She says nothing of another. Never mind. It is not. She leans forward. Please, do not. Oh, no. No. I guess I said the wrong thing. You know what? We've got Fane here. Let's uh, try that a third time. Psst. Go. Get out. You are not welcome here. Go, man pig. She eyes you suspiciously. Please. Nope. Okay. I guess uh, we need you to get your character and stuff, and we can try that a fourth time. <laughs> what? Uh, talking to this lady, because it seems like she's a quest giver, but. Uh, it might be a later quest. Alright. Do you like turtles? Mm -hmm. You ready for this?
turn? Yeah, I'm like I'm looking at it. Uh, yeah, he's got nothing right now he can do. Crap, how many turns you got? Apparently a lot. Nice. Ranger was a good decision. Whoa! Another one. Almost killed that. Now I can start putting damage on him. Uh, Y'all just start attacking him, I'll kill that other one. Too big for this, right? Uh, what? Chicken. No, I don't know. You can probably do it. No. I can't. I can't step too close. It's it's too far away. Damn! What just happened? Get him in the water. <laughs> you did it. Get him in the water. He's burning still. Get in the water. Get in the water. Still burning. Get in the water. Get in the water. Get in the water. Get in the water. Alright, he's fine. I think we just got some mage shit. We don't have a mage. These chests down here. Foolish to attempt an escape by sea in these waters. Crafty weapon. Oh, this one's locked.
Did the uh, turtles have anything on them? Yeah, some fucking wizard shit. Get yourself a bed roll as a bed roll as soon as you can. Yeah, do they uh, use up and stuff? Because I found one no. in uh, Are you sure they're in our game before. Can I use these guys' bed roll? What's up, kitty cat? Come on back. Uh, using that friggin' bedroll for uh, fit, uh, for Fane because like uh, we just ran through some poison that would have healed him. <laughs> That's true. That's it, if you want to go talk to these people. Yep. May as well. Alright. Let me talk to her. Got some bottles of beer on there. Stay back, sorcerer, and stay silent. We know you've been helping sorcerers escape, Atusa. We have proof. I'd sooner cut my tongue out than lie to you, Alexander. I know nothing of any escapees. If you can tell the Godwoken no more, your tongue is of no use. This can't be serious, Alexander. Come! You should know by now to obey your superior, Magister. Whatever she may ask. Lizard. Atusa pinches the tip of her tongue with two fingers and... Stop! My father! May his soul rest the fate of our realm... Dallas? Yeah, yes, yeah, your... Yeah. I... <laughs> what? What a waste. 300 XP for watching a oh. murder. The Lizard Magister, or what's left of her, lies in a puddle of gore. <laughs> There's one Magister fewer for us to worry about. He hasn't changed a bit. These creatures are so prone to violence, naturally, the weaker specimens suffer. Oh, there's a resurrection scroll in the leg in there. There's a, two, there's a resurrection scroll in there, I already have two. Alright, I'll take the resi scroll. I guess I'll take the leg in case. Uh, is the other per is the person you want to get an elf? Um, I think I'm gonna get Sabiel, dude. All right, we're just. Come on, then, Lexi. Hey, uh... Or I mean, I find we could get FN, trouble. but it looks like he's a primary like ranged, you know. Um, it's up to you. I mean, you can be the one controlling that one. Pathetic. You keep his name out of your mouth. Let me do this conversation. You <laughs> Have your cud. Don't let this moss muncher talk to you like that. Especially a cheapskate like this one. Griff already knows she don't like to pay her fair share. 
An intense-looking man steps between the thug and the elf and rolls up his sleeves, revealing well-muscled and heavily scarred arms. Just stand aside, won't you, mate? This is no business of yours. Lone wolves decide their own business. Oh, is he fun? Yeah. The thug freezes in fear for a moment before shuffling back to the protection of his crony. Pay up, elf. No one shorts Griff, especially not one of you. The intense looking man stands beside you against the thugs, shooting you an appraising glance. Burrow looks you both up and down, sizing up your combined threat. Ah, get out of here. The both of you. You ain't worth the sweat of my brow anyhow. The elf smiles and bows to you in thanks. He grips your hand tight as a vice and shakes it, hard. Good to meet you, lady. Say, you don't look all that busy. I could use someone to watch my back, and it looks like you could use someone to watch yours. I've just got a small errand to run, and then I'll be looking to get the hell out of here while I've still got a neck to collar. How about we stick together until we get out of this place? He shrugs, looking off to the side. Mercenaries. It's a job. My job. Everyone needs to make a living. I make mine running errands. The little black cat trailing you hisses at him, hair raising a ridge along its back. Without batting an eyelid, the man rumbles a lupine growl. The cat hides behind your leg, mewling. <laughs> well, the cat's included. That's the truth. For me, for you, for everyone in this place. Why not help each other get out of here? The usual way. Haphazard, terrifying, and drenched in blood. Haven't quite worked out the details yet, but I'll wager it'll be no worse than what'll happen if we stay put. Two heads are better than one. And when push comes to shove, four fists are better than two, right? <laughs> He grins, sharp teeth glittering in the midday sun. So, before we hit the road, it's best if we decide battle strategies up front. Should keep more of our blood in. Survival's my main priority. I'll use every trick in the book to keep us alive. But if a wayfarer's not what you're after, I've got other skills. What do you need? What is wayfarer? I don't know, hold on, let me look it up. so good keep your nose down
I guess we'll stick with Wayfair. Yeah. Because Cleric and you, you and him are our melees. Yeah. We get two range. Can do. Onwards. He scans the horizon for threats with one green eye, then nods back at you. Day, buddy? Yeah. Let's go to the chick in the cave, but we can talk to whoever. Like, we got Lewis right here, Dominic. We can talk to whoever we want. I'm gonna talk to this uh, trader, actually. As you approach the blacksmith, oh. you feel a bony hand on your. If it would be acceptable, and if it would not be acceptable, well, that would render this entire conversation rather awkward. Inflict him on. Wait, what? Oh, that's the blacksmith! Yeah, hold up a hand. You're in charge here, and you're not about to. Inflict. What What? What does he want to do? Uh, and if it would not be acceptable, well, that would render this entire conversation awkward. Uh... Yeah, yeah, let him. Right ahead. Fane approaches the blacksmith and quietly speaks to her. You can't overhear much, but he seems to be gesturing towards her head an awful lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fane's words are quiet, but you hear the blacksmith repeat, Face Ripper, in shock. She slowly starts to back away. What is it with creeps like you and Master Niles? I told him to slither back to his dungeon, and you can get too, freak! Fane backs away, scratching his head. It seems that didn't go as he'd expected. He is lost in thought, though. She must have said something he found interesting. So Niles under the fort would be would help him find a device to rip faces off. As you do. Lockpick. It's, it's expensive stuff. This is Fort Joy. What a crumbling disaster. Careful. Don't want to catch breath in a bad mood. Why hasn't Alexander's a delivery? Surely you'll have one. Scram, snake face. If a magister finds this on you. You forget my name, eh? Yeah? 
Hmm. Maybe you don't speak ancient. What? Griff is slowly, methodically peeling the skin from a potato. What? <clears throat> Who's asking? He smirks and holds the little knife up. I'm listening. Sure, have a look. Good stuff, huh? Here's the goods. Like you wanted. If a magister finds us on you, you forget my name here. Perhaps you I looking for a match? You'll have a good head on most of the competition, that's for certain. A <laughs> good tail, too. Poor lugs won't know what hit them. That's so. Well, then, prove it. Down the hatch with you. Alright, I'm gonna go into the cave and get some stuff. What cave? Uh, the cave with the crazy elf stuff. So, maybe I should kill this. The dog old first. dog whimpers sad. Don't kill the dog. Alright. Oh wait, yeah, actually kill the dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just looked at me killing this dog and he's just like, what are you doing? Outside. You're cheating. Are you from the ancient empire? Maybe you know my mum, Helen. She served the bailiff of the House of Law. She died when the Void Woken came. Suddenly, the child's face crinkles into a grimace. She seems on the verge of sobbing. But... Thank you for your help with that, thug. No doubt he turns on you next. What did you just say? These humans hate us. I'm talking to the uh, the woman near the kids. Oh. She bows. In the cave. Sorry. Yeah. I hear of no escapes. The only way out is through. In this cave, we trust Sahela. She is young, but she sees. She know it gives me great pain. I'm with my family. Oh, reward. Does she give you a reward?
The young girl's eyes are covered, but she turns toward you when you approach. Ah, hello. I see you come a long way. I see you come here seeking a great adventure. Do I see it before my eyes. <laughs> it is not so bad. I know which days have bread and which days have none. I know more bread comes someday. It helps. Your life is not your own. Your luck. Her eyebrows shoot up. There can be a way. Amiro knows. But he is gone. My protector. My friend. An elf like me, with a spirit bright as new leaves. He tries to help me, to save me. And he suffers very. He is caught by those who hurt him. I wish so much for his return. And you bring me great peace. Thank you, my friend. I see something that helps. I see a lizard. He is a lizard of many dreams, of far feeling. You do not free Amiro without him. Yes, please ask. So what did you get from her? Oh, uh, I got the Amaro quest not cover to my free eyes. Amaro from I cover his, the uh, place captive. they used to be. Well, I know they that, are but gone like, now. did Taken. you, um, I what, like, gear did you get from here. him? I am not sure how much to Oh, from the uh, lady? I got you bronze pants. Yeah, and so we are yeah. here. Bronze, bronze pants. Bronze Seemed like the best one out of the uh, choice, really. Uh, what did, did you get anything? No. Okay, I guess it just rewards one person. Damn it. My home is far. Your language gives me some trouble. Okay, I need to go find we a yarrow else. flower. Time. For us is now. There is not then. He is a very blind man. He sees things but not truth, not love oh, or joy. Deal. I feel you understand when you meet him after you escape. It is safer here. We make no trouble for Griff. He makes no trouble for us. Okay. Well, friends with the elf lady now. Uh, where are you? Amid the squalor of Fort Joy, you suddenly spot an elf with diamond features, regal and radiant, but cold too, and sharper than any knife. She was among the sorcerers with whom you fought the Void Woken down in the hold of the sinking ship. Her eyes are focused on a lizard some distance away, and you get the distinct feeling he's an unfortunate man indeed to be trapped in her tiger-like gaze. No sooner have these words left your mouth than she turns about and grabs you in a stranglehold. You feel the tip of a long needle being pushed a little ways into your neck. You caught me off guard. No one catches me off guard. Who are you? No such thing as just another lizard. No such thing as a lizard that means no harm. A push, a pivot, and now you suddenly face her. The needle still all too deeply embedded in the sight. Despite the precariousness of your situation, you notice a flaw in her diamond features a curiously shaped scar on her left cheek. It's dawning on you, isn't it? Why I hate reptiles like you. Forgive me if I don't take your word for it. She drives the needle in deeper and whispers. In truth, it does not matter in the least who you really are. You saw me mark my prey. You could warn him, save him, or kill him before I get my chance. That makes you a liability. That makes you needle feed. Um, Sibyl wants to kill me. 
Why? I spoke to her. <laughs> Your death will be slower, more painful, but fair enough, if you insist. Uh, I might need to kill her to carry on. No, we can't kill her. There's, the only two offer is make her an offer instead of killing you, she could join you, or start a fight. Well, I guess we're not... Here, I'll... Like... Make her an offer instead of killing you, she could join you. I could I could make the offer, see what goes from there. Never. Nope, she said never. Okay, well, I mean Guess we're gonna have to kill Sabeel. You are a lizard, perhaps a slaver. Why should I freely chain my fate to one like you, like I was once forced She's to? not going to be a part of this playthrough anyway. We already have our party set, you know? Yeah. I hate to say it, but you make sense, fork tongue. Oh, little needle mine, what should I do? Push or pull? Get out of here, Magister. Mm -hmm. You know what? Today is a rather fine day. Sunsh I'm not quite sure the weather will save him. With a casual Where's flick of the wrist, she withdraws the needle from your neck and smiles, She's as if she just invited you to sit She's down smiling. for tea. Let's discuss our respective roles then. You, me, and Death will be playing many a round of high. As a rogue, my speciality is stealth. The quick silence of the dagger striking unseen. Wait, you're recruiting her? That said, I'm perfectly. That uh, was my only choice, so we had to fight. Or magic, but of course. I can play the strings of magic like suits me fine. Lead on, or better yet, a bit fickle, are we? Huh? You want a bit hers? Fickle, are we? No. Huh? We'll have to work oh, on that. Okay, so you're just gonna have to. I can't. I can't get out of it though. Click, click offer. No. Click on like no. Click on some one of the options. Uh, I clicked on. Okay. And then go. I can play the strings of magic like a harpist, her instrument. Change Is there any mind. specific? A bit fickle, are we? And then it just goes huh? back we'll to, to what? On that. What okay. class do you want to be? Yeah. Ready? All right. So if I go, okay. But of course, I can play the strings of magic like a harpist, Can't her hit instrument. Her? It suits me fine. Lead on, or better yet, let me take the lead. Here we go. There you go. Oh, she's fine now. Yeah, cool. Alright, we're done. Oh, no, we're fighting. Finn, uh, I, Ethan.
Sorry, Sidra. Sorry. Need aid. Sorry. So sorry. Anything on it? Yeah. The red skull. Okay. And a shield. And the hammer. Nothing I can use. Let's go kill this fuck stick. Grab this orange from him. Alright, cool. Like a dreamer, you should. Oh, I was so close. And you smell of burnt hair and barren dreams. But I had the good breeding not to mention it. So close to the dream. Okay, I need to go talk to uh, Thingy about the thing before. Attacks range, Spain? Uh, no, they're actually uh, in this variation of him, most of them are melee, but his uh, restoration is uh, ranged. So I'm just gonna pop him over here, make sure he stays alive all the time. Uh, I hope to get a bow for him actually. I'm gonna like make sure he gets like bow or something, some sort of ranged weapon. Crossbow, that'd be cool. I mean, but I think that clerics use melee, though. I think that's like part of their. Is that thing. part of the thing? Okay. Yeah, we need melee for him. He's in an awkward spot there. Oh, that guy's got a cross. Yeah, it makes no sense to have the um, the cleric guy do close range stuff of shit.
speed, dude. Hell, myself. <laughs> well, I got the orange. And okay. Stuff. Let's see what I can have. Repair hammer. I actually have a lot of shit. Do you want any of the shit I'm carrying, by the way? Uh, give the magnifying glass to Bane, because he has uh, Lore Master, so he can he can identify shit. Uh, uh, not really, no, man. I'm yeah. good. Right. Uh, maybe that craft weaponry bows thing? Maybe that? Oh, bowstring? Yeah. No, not bowstring, the, the book. Craft weaponry bows. I can. Are you too far away? Uh, no, just right click on it and click send to. Uh, I, think, I think you're too area. far away. Hold on, let me catch up with you. I don't, I don't think so. Take it out of things. No, you gotta right click on the book and click transfer to uh, um, Aria's. Yeah, send to Aria. Okay, yeah, duh. Sorry. <laughs> Here we go, look at that. Learn a new recipe. Alright, I'll talk to this. Dude. Where are you going? Where are you going? I ain't fit for beasts. Why don't you go Mac on your girl? I've got that just, uh, Griff this glances from his blade yeah, to you Mac. and back Mac. again. Oh my Quick. bro. <clears throat> Bloody elves. What's I up, guess butter? you mean the clown I caught stealing from my kitchen. <laughs> He's not going anywhere. Caught him red-handed trying to make off with a second crate after he took the first. <laughs> Went down like a rent boy when we grabbed him. Easy. <laughs> Supplies. A crate of food, citrus in particular. <clears throat> he'll talk, or he'll die quiet. All I want is my supplies. <clears throat> Happy to let this clown die in a gutter instead of my kitchen. Bring back my crate, and you got yourself a deal. Griff tears into one of the oranges with both hands. Juice squirts through his hands as he desperately rips through the rind. Looks like everything's accounted for. Now the important question. Who's the thief? He raises an eyebrow. Looks like someone did my job for me. Your guy's free to go. He should be fine. <laughs> Eventually. What happened with him? He gave it back? Now he's unlocking yep. it? Yep. Okay. It is done. And quickly. 
I hold my end of the bargain. I show you the way out. But I have something more to ask of you. Sahela, she is... She is everything. So there's a lot it more for us to do, so we're not going to go do anything with this for, yet, okay? Give me your... Ma I give you this. I go to her. Right. He goes over there. He's given us a couple of things. That's fine. What do you what give you? Uh, a couple more quests. Special shipment you was asking after. Worse than war rations, these. Oh, let's go to Ira, see if she's got any reward. He is free. He comes. He comes back to me. Sahela, you are all right. I am fine, Amiro. I am fine. I know they help us. Yes, they do. It is as you say. Sit, my friend. Come. As you say. As you say. She breaks into a huge, childlike grin as you approach. One friend brings another home. Thank you. He gets better, little by little. We are together. We always get better if we are together. Her face falls at the mention of her home. Her hands fly instinctively to her eyes, as if to wipe away tears. But she stops herself. My people, I miss them. But they cannot save me. It is not to be. We stay in Fort Choi. They stay elsewhere. This is the way. This is the only way. Homeland is gone. Home is wherever my people are. My mother is amongst them. Tova, a great elf. I do not mind Fort Joy, but I miss her very much. Yes, it is a deep hurt. In my tribe, we say, the heart lives in the family cookpot. It is true, I think. Thank you, my friend. But only you survive the passage. I see it. There's a two-handed sword we at must this remain. chick that she's selling if you haven't found one yet. Okay, cool. Thank you, dear one. She squeezed. I do not forget. Oh. Uh, do you have to be in the vicinity to get these things, or...? 
Like three watts? No, it's the person that talks to him. So that it's only one person gets it. Okay, do you want these gloves? Like, because it's armor. Sure. I, I, I picked up some armor. Is it finesse though? It's magical sewn scale gloves. I know, but what do they use? Finesse or strength or intelligence? Uh, magic and physical. No, I know, but below it doesn't say like what they require. Yeah, I do want to have a look. I'll, I'll send them to you. And if you don't want them, send them back. Yeah. Okay, those would be good for you because they're for strength. Okay, cool. Going back to you here in a second. this uh, necklace be any good for you though? Plus one intelligence. That'll be good for Fane. Uh, one, but we're collared right now so we can't use them yet. Okay, cool. Give this Perhaps back to you. Bleeding dwarves did need so much. Give that to pain. I got some boots. Take those. Perhaps if those bleeding dwarves did need so much. Don't tell anyone where you got this, okay? Take your coin, okay. then. We need to go around talking to people. I ain't fit for beasts. Everybody, talk to everybody, get fucking quests. I don't know any ancient empire ditties. Got nothing spicy enough to keep my mind off this place for a few bars. <laughs> don't break your head, Vane, now. Been that long since you've been home, has it? Yeah, pity. Pity. Give us a smile. The woman is scrabbling at her throat, as though she can hardly breathe. Hmm. Don't touch me! You're too close. This collar, this place, it's squeezing the life from me. Do you? You seem fine. Don't you feel how tight this collar is? And there's nothing we can do. Her hands move again to her throat. She seems to try to make space between her neck and the collar, but there's no space to be made. It's getting <gasps> tighter. I can. Hey, uh, what do you know? Name's Laszlo, thanks, and uh, I'm not sure I follow. You're being coy. Not last time I checked. I'm talking about the crate. Oh, don't forget to sleep in a The bed. missing supplies. You heard about it. You. You there. You, you've just arrived, isn't that right? Are you... Are you quite alone? It's just... I have a proposition. Something, something very worth knowing, but it's hardly a group affair. I only need one. Oh, 
Oh, I think he has a quest. Yeah, tell him you're alone or whatever. Oh, sure. ten bottles of meat. Oh. I'm just gonna sell some stuff. Thousand bottles of dust. Yeah. Fifty bottles of tears. Oh, make the hinges rust. When another divine arrives, will a source change back? In that case, listen up. You must think me mad to approach a stranger, but this camp is full of cowards and I'm running out of time. Fast. Too fast. Way too fast. I've been here a long time. Longer than anyone else. People get taken sometimes. Some folks say they get cured. I don't know if I believe it, and I don't want to wait and find out. I have a way out of here. It won't be easy, and I need a partner. Are you interested? Had a boy. Who wouldn't? Finally someone with a little sense around here. The plan's simple. Completely foolproof. Completely foolproof. I have a spell that I can use to teleport you right out of here. I can't use it on myself, but with your help, we can both get out of here. There's an artifact that you can use to teleport me out of this place. Then I can use my spell to free you in turn. Uh, this item, though, it's in quite an unfortunate location. It's found its way into a nest of crocodilians on a secluded beach nearby. Here, here give me your map and I'll show you where to go. Not enough to trouble a fine specimen such as yourself. Get that artifact. And you and I are as good as free. Go give those lizards. Pardon? What for? All right. Uh, so he wants me to go oh, kill some lizards. He's marked it on the map. What of it? Yeah, what of it? I see. Yep. Where is he sending you? It's over this way. Oh, to go kill the crocodiles? Yeah. Yeah, we gotta get the teleportation gloves. Teleportation? It's not that way, it's this way. Oh. Uh, you should get... Uh... Ethan to sleep in that bed first as well. Maybe. that guy? Oh, it's a beast. It's a crab. Oh, you, you talking to... Oh, my God. Yeah. Laughing in the faces of my enemies, of course. Little do they know the most powerful sorcerer the world has ever known scuttles on their very shores. <laughs> Power is my birthright, same as yours, but one of us has grown to astounding heights and the other has sunk into depths too humiliating to describe. Pity. But of course, they'll happily dump your maggot ridden corpse into the sea when they're through with you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, of course, precious, but which is worse, the cure of the disease? 
sorcerers dance while magistrates pull the strings. Fools all! Their tomfoolery won't save them from the destruction of the age shall wreak upon them. <laughs> nice. Oh, that crap. Oh, there it goes. Let's do the try to assassinate the fucking red train. He say he likes it thick and long. What's over here? Just long. it out all dilly eye day. Miss house. He say he likes it big and strong. XP for something. Oh, it's a fight. Oh, should I go around this side? Oh, there's three crocodiles that are kind of big. And you didn't make Finn sleep either. <laughs> Alright. Shit. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's just gonna make, uh... Fane heal him. You can all get real nice and close to each other. That's actually a good idea. Move at him. I'll put some fight out. Okay. Some sort of defense. That's right, keep coming, keep coming. Yeah, you stay there. Oh, fuck. Can you get that uh, barrel? Which barrel? The barrel the crocodile's right on. It's a fight. It's an oil barrel. Hmm. Yeah! Fire. 
definitely move. Uh, where is Fane? Why isn't he fighting? I don't know why Fane isn't fighting. He's not interested in this fight. Take control. Click on. Double click on his portrait and move him closer to the fight. And then he'll become a part of it. It's, I mean, I'm sure we got this regardless, but. Uh. One more crocodile. What? Shouldn't be able to get you up there. Wow. Definitely use a healing potion. Yep. yep. Or heal the thing can heal you at all. He cannot, but he can. Back. Walk over here. <laughs> oh shit. Teleporting my fuck down.
heal. I'm gonna die. Yeah, he doesn't have healing. Seized it. You don't have a potion on Goomba? Oh, yeah, Goomba had a potion, but. Just in his life, I'm gonna have to that. Oh shit, it's teleporting. Nice. Can you kill this one? Otherwise it's gonna kill the Yeah, so the problem was at the start of this fight we didn't have all of our party like, fighting and I've got don't have enough long range so Yeah. Got the gloves. Cool. Kona resurrected yeah. because they are expensive yes they are um one of us but maybe like i maybe i can do it to if and or myself but i need to we need to put uh levels into harder because it makes shit so much easier how do i uh, split a stack oh there we go Alright, so both me and Fane still have a uh, freaking resurrection. There's a locked chest. Huh? There's a locked chest? Yeah, hiding in these bushes around the back here. Huh. Do you have, do you have, nice. Did you get a lock pick? No. Oh. I don't have any thievery either, so it probably wouldn't work.
so. I know where there is a chest that I'm in, that we can go get though right now. Come on, okay. with me. I am. I am follow. I am follow. Lead me, master. We gotta go up and fight those three gamblers too. Get that XP. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me uh, rest in the bed. You can, you can, can you'll, you'll be able to catch up with me. Let's carry on. We're not going to fight, are we? No, it's just the right. location with a crate or a chest or whatever. Oh yeah, there's a chest up there. Yeah. What? Hold on, maybe we gotta go over here. Try standing on the uh, the bit of rock below it. There you go. What'd you get? A one-handed maze and some armor. Nice. Might as well pop that on him. One-handed maze can go to fucking Fane. Can do. He's using sort or like one-handed and shield right now, isn't he? Uh, yeah, he's using uh, what's he using? Uh, yeah, claw hammer, four to five physical. Yeah. Nine to ten physical. So I guess let's go back and talk to fucking Galafag. 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 Wait, 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 wait. What is this portrait in the middle of this fucking shrine right now? Have you seen this? Where are you? Just as you come in. You gonna pray all day, buddy? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Apparently it's got cogs on it. Ah, this Lucian everyone seems so interested in. I don't see it myself. The Divine himself, Lucian. Shrines turned into a memorial, it seems. That's quite the statue. The shrine depicts Lucy and the Divine, avatar of the seven gods. Uh, maybe we should actually, we're gonna wait on this, because this dude's pretty fucking tough. We're gonna go do a couple not of things. Alright, cool, because I need to uh, get the rest. Uh, where's the bed? Oh, I'm gonna be arrested, go back to the elf cave. I told him at noon. Divine arises, 
Will source change back? What if there are no source of Holy shit, I found Where 110 is gold, man. He? Nice. If you don't like the game, Topsy, you can fold. What, what did you do? I call court. Pay up. Hey, bring Fane into the cave when you do. I'm trying to see if we can. There's a way in the back that's blocked by a bunch of poison. Yeah. Right. Get him to go through there. I'll go. Uh, I'll come to the cave now. Hey, hold on, before you go through, before you go through, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your portrait, uh -huh. you're gonna click on Fane's portrait, and then you're gonna take your portrait and drag it to the side, like, into the center of the screen. So and it'll separate them. So that way you can take Fane through. Okay. So that you can walk through with Fane. Find stuff. Shop rock and gold. Does water counteract poison? Poisoned fish pie, that would be good for Fang. Uh, maybe. Am I searching this whole cavern or? It does. It does water does counteract poison? Alright, cool. What have you found so far? Uh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. There's a spot that I can, uh, teleport someone up to. There we go. 
Oh, I found the shovel. I've got a shovel. Something isn't right here. It could be an ambush. Oh, no. Ambush. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Amphibians, three of them? Okay. I don't see the other ones though, but they are on the. Uh... Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, there's the charged one. Um... Yeah, they are a thing. Nope, there's you. Straight into fire. Uh. Nice. <laughs> We gotta level up. Can we do that while we're fighting? Yeah.
Let's go. Why? Kill these guys, like, and just start doing damage. I'll say. Don't run. No, you need to hit them, man.
head. God damn it! It's like ages until uh, Goomba's turn. side. Fuck, he just created electricity though. Yeah. Wanna come back towards uh yeah. yeah. So I resurrect, uh... Yeah, resurrect him. Please. Oh, damn it, I can't. So I move. Can't? Yeah, because I like to move two steps. So I'll run up here. Come on, I meant to move. Ah, oh dear. Okay. Yeah, I need to get used to this control system. Like, I wanted to, like, I tried the range of the uh, tentacle whip and stuff, but it was out of range and stuff, so I went to move forward and instead of just the tentacle whip anyway. So. Got this. Whack. Whack him again. Yeah. I'll yeah. yield to none. Just, uh... yeah. The reason for 
okay. Fanny can stop writing things now. Piece of mind scroll, wooden figure, gold, improvised staff. Take all of that shit. We got our resurrection scroll back from one of these had one. Nice, that's something. Uh, is that all of them? There's no one, isn't there? I got this for you if you want it. Chest. What's going on? Oh, I'm looking at it the wrong back. Right, okay. Scale up. Nice. Uh. Is iPhone any good with um, lock picks? Do you think? Let me check his shit. Hello. All right. I don't think any of us has any thievery. We should probably save. Like once you get over here with me, over here and we'll save and have this as one of our saving spots, you know? Yeah. Name the game or whatever, Grim and Scooter or whatever you name. To remember. this the ancient stone hatch that is one of the ways out cool we're gonna go in there well that's a lot of uh, XP. Shit, i should really open things with uh, Goomba. Gumbo's got like a lucky charm, so every so often he just like hits the jackpot. Ah, you're back. And you brought. But, but who is this? brought an adult here. Good, good gods. Can it be? What is 
is this? A thousand years? Gods, the walls of this pit have leached a whole millennium from me. <laughs> I haven't seen a living soul in all that time. What a strange notion. <laughs> that would be so fucked up. A wicked king, it was. Bracchus Rex by name. The Order of the Source Hunters discovered a great horror upon this prison isle, and I was sent to stop it. Yet, my failure was absolute. I am not fit to bear the insignia of the Source Hunters any longer. Please, good lady, you must free me. Prize this spear from my chest, where it has been stuck fast for the last thousand years. Seize the spear. End this degradation. I beg you. All right. Come, come grab the spear, Mr. Two-Handed Weapons Guy. Yeah. Go, Goomba, go, Goomba, go. Let me get that out. Oh, I got it! Good, okay. sir. You have set my body free. Free to crumble to dust at last. But my spirit... Blast! I remain trapped in this moldering skeleton yet. That would I do. But there is strong magic at play here. I am bound still. Even as my body shall crumble, my very soul remains trapped in my bones. A spell most terrible. I have heard of such magic, but have never known anyone so foul as to employ it. Bracchus Rex, may maggots lace his entrails. After he interred me in this cell, he must have drawn my very soul away from me and stored it elsewhere in the fort. Thus, he has bound me entirely to the mundane realm. But I know this place well. I could lead you to its likely location. In turn, you would find a path straight out of this fort. My freedom for yours. What say you? Marvelous, my friend. Marvelous. You'll first have to get inside the fort itself. There's a secret switch on a statue of the Seven in the courtyard. Surely you know it. The switch will open a hatch, and you'll be led into the prison's main floor. I suspect that within Bracchus's phylactery room, you will find the container which ensnares my soul. He has likely disguised it well, but search there for another hidden switch. Bracchus would have made me a supplicant, a slave to these walls. With your help, I'll die. At last, with dignity. Dude, this game is so fucking good. It is. Um, anything more about <laughs> the island, or soul is kept? Uh, Stevie, yeah, Stevie knows anything more about the island. Fort Joy is a dangerous place, my friends. Dangerous indeed. Yeah, we've seen Bracchus that. used this place to build an arsenal of terrible weaponry as yet unseen in our world. Here, he and his researchers crafted punishments and snares contrary to human dignity. Objects that could contain souls. Ones that could purge the very essence from sorcerers. My order would never have used such barbaric magic against our enemies. I was fully briefed about this awful place before I came. My goal was to destroy the fiend who had been marshalling the world's most unwholesome weapons and magic into an army he intended to use against the realm. I never thought I would become one of his victims, and yet, here I am. Wow, he's huge. He is a big fucking... So if we're going back out here, I'm going to go uh, take a sleep at one of those beds. The frogs are gone. The children shall be... What did you just get XP for? 
I don't know. I just like spoke to that woman. Nice. Mm. Mm. It is good. I see it. Didn't even see her about XP there. Um, might have to end off right here, dude. Might have to go to sleep. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I you think wanna, we. You want to resave it? Yeah, resave yeah. it. Save Over it. the same one. All right. Uh, we are safe in the cave with the uh, prison imprisoned elves, and so ends this journey. You are quite safe. I am so glad. Oh, this is good. Alright, I exited the game. Yeah, shut down.